you know, from the day we were founded um, 11 years ago, uh, we said we, water and power are uh, basic uh, needs of uh, economic development, uh, sustenance of uh, social stability, and in fact, uh, uh, of life. Um, so given the basic nature uh, of this commodity or these commodities, I think it's inconceivable that it should be entirely in private hands, that over time uh, that we should have public as shareholders. But we need to get the company to a position where the minute you start having public as shareholders, to be fair, you need to make sure that the risk, the company risk has been substantially de-risked and that there is the ability to make profit on a steady basis so that we can pay dividends. Uh, no investor is going to be happy uh, putting money into a company uh, and say, wait for another five years while I build assets uh, to give you some money back. So we needed to take our time in order to build a portfolio of assets and establish a platform that was going to start to generate a steady uh, dividend yield, uh, which then we can then start to share. So in that journey, we started out with some private shareholders. We were founded by three private shareholders. Then we brought on another five more uh, private shareholders. Then we brought a couple of institutional shareholders, Saudi sovereign uh, uh, entities. Then we brought in International Finance Corporation. And so the next logical thing for us is to now open up the shareholding to uh, public. And we've always said we're a Saudi company. We will list in Saudi Arabia first. We have been working on that during the course of 2014 as we come into 2015. But in terms of actual sort of launch date, uh, all the details around it, it's all subject to uh, regulatory approvals. So until, so there comes a time when we, are, we actually cannot discuss much more until we've got all the regulatory approvals in place. And then we can formalize uh, a launch process and then within the bounds of the regulation, we can come out and sort of say much more than what we can say. So today, what I can confirm to you is that we absolutely are committed to uh, broadening the shareholder base to inc including the public. So there will be uh, an IPO, but that IPO is subject to regulatory approvals and the time frame is all dependent on uh, agreeing with the regulator. Uh, but we're very much preparing for it.